Hi guys and welcome to today's video. We are off to a show and this time we're not riding, we are bringing Violet and that is because we are gonna be doing a halter and showmanship class with her. Kate really wanted to start showing her just to get her used to the environment and so that she has that experience. If you've been following our channel, then you know that Kate has been working at a training facility for young horses for the last approximately year and she works with professional trainers People send their horses to this facility from all over the world. They're horses that are destined to go for high level competing and so they work with training these horses. They have Grand Prix horses there among others so Kate has been gaining all kinds of wonderful skills for training the young horse for good ground manners, things like that. And so she's been starting to work with Violet for those things. We'll be posting videos about that. Before we get into the video, go ahead and click the subscribe button and hit the bell to select all so you don't miss any of our videos. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends and family about us too. It's the only way we can grow and that YouTube knows you're enjoying our videos. Be sure to follow us on Instagram and TikTok as well for extra content and behind the scenes footage. Let's get into the video. One of the things that she's doing has been working with her just recently. She's been working with her for showing, halter leading, things like that. She's always led with a halter, but I mean, in the ring and doing the patterns. So she just wanted to give it a try. We'll see how it goes. Violet's never been off property other than to come to our place when we first bought her. So and she was with her mom. Yeah, and she was with her mom. So today she's coming by herself. She's a really confident baby and she's good about being by herself. She loads really well on a trailer. She self loads on a trailer, but we're gonna see how she does after this drive. <laughs> hey, it's not as bad as the drive. And being to get off to property. She got back on after that drive. She's gonna get back on tonight. Yeah. Yeah, the drive to our place was I don't remember how long that was, like eight hours I think it took okay. us that night. It was a long it was drive because it was from okay. out of province that we bought her, so <laughs> That was a long trip, but we're gonna see how she's gonna do. And again, it's all just a learning experience. A nice, inexpensive community riding club show, and so we thought, why not? We're gonna actually be meeting our friends from Day by Day Vlogs. We told them about it, so they're gonna be bringing one of their horses to do a halter and showmanship class as well. We're almost there, so we'll see you in a minute. Hey, bro, don't you look at that? I said, my friend, what you looking at? I don't know, we've never been here. It wasn't here last time. Still got poop on your head. Yeah, she took a nice nap in her and some poo. She literally chooses to sleep in poo. She'll find the poo. She'll poo to just in. to sleep in it. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, such I, a mess I her, I cleaned her stall at like, I think I went out again at like 11 o'clock at night and like cleaned up. She naps half the night. Like laying down. Oh no, the blanket like made me all weird. No, I know. Her whole man was, she had like a, it parted right down here. So I had to like wet it with extra hair is out. So Scott's just giving Kate tips on halter showing. He obviously has no idea how to halter show horses, but he grew up on a dairy farm and so he has spent his whole life showing 
dairy cattle. He lived at the Royal Winter Fair, which is a huge fair that happens here every year. But again, just showing cows. So Kate wasn't going to do showmanship because she actually doesn't know much about it, but she figured she'll give it a try just to give Violet a bit more experience being in the, in the ring. This is her very first time off property and she's doing amazing. So we were actually trying to practice yesterday with the showmanship and just finishing getting Violet ready, but all of a sudden a storm came through so quickly it turned course and headed our way. So Kate was in the arena and lightning hit and then all of a sudden she was like get the horses in so we ran got the horses in i ran to go get chickens in while kate and scott were getting horses in then i realized i couldn't get them in fast enough as the rain started to pound i ran into the house just as julia was coming out i was laughing at her the whole time she was trying to get chickens in she's got like she's like hovering it was raining like so hard and it was on. hailing like loony size. Her, so, her like, raincoat, she might as well have not worn it. Yeah, we were absolutely. She drenched. honestly probably, she probably would have been drier if she didn't wear it. I've never been more wet in my life. And the funny thing is, is we were supposed to be at a horse show, but because of the iffy weather, it ended up getting canceled. Thank God. But we had hail coming down, like about this big. We had over an inch of rain in a matter of I think like 15 minutes. The winds were so strong. I was trying to lift the roof off the coop and we literally had rivers going through our property, a lake in the paddock. The manure pile was under about two feet of water. It was just a disaster. We couldn't get the chickens in fast enough. They were trying to take cover, but they were getting so waterlogged because it came so quickly. Our coop ended up having water coming through the roof at the peak. It was just insane. All right, we're going in. Let's go. See how she does. We've got Sophie here with Willow. You guys are doing halter and showmanship as well? Yeah. Oh, so cute. Her Oh, you did a nice elastics. job with her banding. They're going to all fall out. They've all been snapping. We put like... Poor Violet. Well, she, we can't do anything. Breed standard for her is the way we've done her mane and not to have her forelock done, but we tried braiding her tail. It looks a disaster. It, yeah, it's a disaster. Oh well. <laughs> we'll get better. We're falling out, we have reached disaster. Don't fall out. Don't know what we're gonna be after. Yeah, this is her first time off property and she just started like, I think she's practiced this course like one, one or two days. <laughs> Alright, so Kate is up next. This is Violet's first show ever. First time off property.
know, I know we can save it. Cause we're like Alpha and Omega. Even if we go all out and break us down, you yeah, could work it out. Cause we're like Alpha and Omega. Even if we go all out and break us down, you yeah, could work it out. So she should have been standing facing the judge the whole time and squared up while she was talking. She's really good at doing that at home. <laughs> Not here though. She's still doing really good considering this is her very first time off property. Walk halfway down the line. Stop. Back up two horse lengths, so eight steps. Violet's just starting to work on this. That didn't happen. And then a three quarter turn and a trot. And stand. There, now she's standing. <laughs> Corner. Not exactly what you were supposed to do there, Violet, but it was your first time. The you judge liked how in the first class I didn't yeah. go fiddling around with her to make it perfect because it would have made her more nervous. She was like, you handled it very well. Oh. Very nice. She completely understands why she's a little restless <laughs> with the rain. And so what did she ask you? Yeah, she was like, who's your horse? And I said, Violet, she, like, she's just a girl. And then she was like, you handled it like very well and stuff like that. Did she ask you any questions about her or anything? Other than her, like, just her, just like, her name, and name and age. Yeah. You did a good job, baby girl. Yeah, first time off property. She's done very good. I was expecting a little Like she's worse. never seen other horses like this, other, this many people all at once. I fully expected her to slightly spook at the ribbon. <laughs> yeah, she's not spooking at anything. Enjoy your weeds. She's done really good. All the trailers haven't worried her. Show. The people showing in the other ring, or well, I guess they're warming up over there right now, but like none of that spooking her. She's doing really good. Considering it's her very first time and she's a baby. And first place goes to 231. Violet! You got a first place ribbon! You look good in red. Good girl! And the number one! She's like, can I eat the weeds? Thank you. She did really good. She did so good! Alright, I'm going home because it's starting to rain. <laughs> And you're done, So are right? we. Yep, we're going home. Grandma came to watch. And Sophie got a second. So exciting.